Hey guys, Double here, and welcome to my new side LP thing of The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess Blind. Yeah, Matt was wondering how I possibly hadn't played this game yet, but when my old TV broke and the Wii went back downstairs, I just sort of stopped playing it, and I decided I want to play it again, and then I'm like, why don't I LP it? So I'm just going to use the default names, um, yeah, Link and Epona. <sighs> That's pretty okay. How do I change it if it's not, though? Uh, okay. I think there's a cutscene. Tell me, do you ever feel a strange sadness as dusk falls? They say it's only it's the only time when our world intersects with theirs. The only time we can feel the lingering regrets of spirits who have left our world. This is why loneliness always pervades the hour of twilight. I actually kind of hate when games like have different text colors and icons and stuff. Like, Mario Galaxy's really bad for that. Like, it, like, just that hour of Twilight thing. I hope that's not a common theme in this game. But enough talk of sadness. I have a favor to ask of you, Link. I was supposed to deliver something to the royal family of Hyrule the day after tomorrow. Yes, it was a task set to me by the mayor. But would you like to go in my steed? You have never been to Hyrule, right? In the kingdom of Hyrule, there is a ca great castle, and all around it is Castletown, a community far bigger than our little village. And far bigger than Hyrule is the rest of the world the gods created. You should look upon it with all your own eyes. It's getting late. We should head back to the village. I will talk to the mayor about this matter. Shouldn't you have asked him first before, like, getting my hopes up? Cutscene, hurry up! I don't know, I just don't like talking over cutscenes. It's weird for me. Hey, hey Link! You there? Mind helping me herd the goats? They ain't listening to me lately. Hey, where's the pona? <sighs> Stupid girl. Now hurry up and bring a pono with you. Uh, was, did they go this way? 
Hey, where are you going with that opponent? Hurry on him. Okay. Guess it's this way. Not this way. This way. Uh, so Z does that. B does nothing. A rolls. D pad does nothing. C does this. Cool. Minus does that. Plus does that. One does that. And two. Um. I don't know what that really does. Gets rid of your mini map, I guess. But whatever. Anyway, um, before I continue on with stuff, just because I know there's going to be a cutscene and I'd like to explain, I have played part of this game. I've played, I think, yeah, just after I got the iron boots. Uh, then I stopped. So, yeah. That's cool. So, this won't really be blind until then. I really didn't like what I played, but I heard that it gets a lot better later on. So, yeah, that should be fun. Pona for you. Get on, Bob, bitch. Yeah, I see. Opponent's controls aren't much different. To what they were in Ocarina of Time is and what I mean by that is it crashes into like everything. I don't know if I'm just bad at controlling or if that's actually a flaw. Because I've never actually seen anyone play this game. And in case you couldn't tell, I am playing the Wii version. Uh it's the Nintendo Select if there's any difference whatsoever between the normal and Nintendo Select versions. I know there's a difference between the Wii and GameCube. Uh, I think the Wii one is mirrored because Link's left-handed, but most players are right-handed. I don't know really what we... Oh wait, never mind. Figured it out myself. Porter's kind of going too fast for my liking. I mean, I, I can see enjoying Epona in Hyrule Field, where it's big and open, because I know Hyrule Field's in this game. However, in this small little village area, it's kind of annoying to ride her. Clop de clop clop clop! I think those flowers replace Epona's song in this game. Clop, tick, clop. So let's talk to this guy. Sorry to get you over here in such a hurry, Link. These guys have been awful skittish lately. They won't listen to words I say. Sorry to ask, bud, but how about you and Epona herd him up into the barn real quick? We ain't got much time, so you think you can do it for me? Is this going to be like some timed thing that if you fail you have to redo the whole thing, which doesn't make sense by as we don't got much time? Much obliged there, bud. Okay, then go on and herd all these little scamps into the barn for me. Oh, we're whooping. I only got one. Hey, whoop. Whoop. Oh, why is he pissed? Why is he pissed? Is he gonna attack? Why is he attacking? Ow. Okay, let's try going around. 
seeing if I can scare multiple. Oh yeah, three! Bada bing, bada boom! So, uh, yeah. What I might do later on is, um, try and get, like, heart pieces people tell me about or something. I don't know. You can't see spoilers being a big problem. Oh, shit. Ow! Such a dick. Okay, at least the tongue. It's not like. Eh, wrong way, you asshole. This just not like some stupid timed thing that never makes sense when they say we don't have much time. Because then when they say that we don't have much time, when you fail, you have to redo the whole thing. Which, I don't know about you guys, but if I say we don't have much time to do something. And then someone fails to do it. I don't redo all the work they did manage to do in that time period and say, here you go, redo it now. It just sounds like an asshole thing to do. Go in the fucking barn. There we go. I like my old policy of if this is an M rated game, I'll use M rated language. If this is a T rated game, I'll use T rated language. Sort of left. I don't know when I started not using that policy anymore. I have a feeling too much whooping is what causes them to go all red. Okay, let's try going. Well, that guy's not doing anything. Gear, buddy! Yeah! Oh, okay. I also know there is like the Twilight hack, which cut the homebrew channel. But, yeah. Link, opponent, much obliged to both of you. I can cover everything tomorrow without having to trouble you, so sit back and relax, bud. How do you know that? Oh, but, uh, how about today? Wanna practice with the fences? Just wait a spell, bud. I'll get the fences set up. Why don't you close the barn doors first so the goats don't get back out? Oh, sir, that took so long. Okay, then, you'll ride them all you want. Get tired of riding, just jump the gate and head back to the village, okay, bud? Whee! Let's ride! Oh, here's a fence. <laughs> oh, it's dark. Hopefully Lynx doesn't have, like, some girlfriend. He's gonna complain when he's late. What? I wanna hop them both, because... I'm not sure if this is like awkward enough time where you hop the direct center, you get the. You get a blue rupee, I think it is. It doesn't look like it. Okay, so the exit's over here. Damn. <sighs> Why couldn't you just open the gate? Is this like supposed to be teaching me how to use a Pona properly or something? Oh my god! Okay, let's just... I didn't even see that. I have a feeling opponent... What?! Come on, game. I wonder if this is like Skyward Sword where you can get rid of those controls. That's another game I need to beat. I don't know, doing a blind LP of that. Why can't I hop the fence? Doing a blind LP of Skyward Sword seems useless because I think I made it like right up to the final boss. There we go! So, that just seems pretty useless to LP that, but whatevs. Uh, no, I don't really. To save. Okay. So it's not gonna be like Majora's Mask. Ba -da -bum. Yay, there's a baby. Hey. hey, wake up, Link! It's morning already! Oh my god, it's my house! This is a cool house. I mean, the ladders everywhere are kind of annoying, but 
What else? Anything over here? Oh, there's a basement. Seriously, why ladders? Why not stairs? Were stairs not invented during this time period? Because I'm pretty sure this game is like one of the later ones in the timeline. So... Yeah, that... Why, why is it dark? Can't see... Let's go to the very end. Can we climb on shit? Okay, let's just go back up. I think we get a lantern pretty early, so I guess I'll use that once we're here. Climb faster! I'm changing the Wii Remote! Uh, what's here? Doesn't look like anything. Let's just leave. Let's just leave! And climbing down the ladder, dropping down. Talk to the kids. Oh, Link, did you hear? They're selling a slingshot at the store right now. A slingshot! I wonder how powerful it is. I wonder how powerful it is. I need, I must try it. Tallow, if you and Mallow want it so badly, just buy it at my parents' shop. Do you see any rupees in my hand? I can't afford that thing. Come on, Beth, can't you just loan it to us for a while? I know I'd get in trouble for that. If you two want it, save up your allowances or something. But our allowances are terrible. Oh, I wish I was born into a family with a slingshot instead of one with a water wheel. That sounds like fun. So, do I need a pony or something? Hi Link, you have the day off work today, right? So I finished the fishing rod I was making. Link, I figured to give it to you first thing in the morning, but my dad said you just wait till Link comes to get it, so I didn't bring it to you. Cool, I get a fishing rod. Trade families. Okay, how about if I talk to just her? Nope. Okay, let's go to the town then, I guess. Well, the map got massively upgraded. I don't recall it being that big. Actually, looking at the time, I think I'll do this shiznas next time. So I will see you guys then.